in this video I'm just doing my everyday makeup routine it's so simple very easy and so glowy and you can use this type of makeup for like you know making tiktoks <laughs> or anything like that or just you know, want to take a selfie and yeah everything like that or just video call with the partner maybe <laughs> and this is how I doing my makeup a lot recently and I link it down below any of my other social media if you want to check that out you can go to the description box below so I'm not gonna talk too much before I get into the video but please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and comment down below and don't forget to subscribe please this is my very first youtube video ever so please subscribe and with all that being said, I think we can just hop right in. Um, before I'm doing my makeup, I usually stick this headband on my head. I know it makes me look like a kid, which is so fun. For real though, guys, starting my makeup, I'm using this Cos RX. This is Korean brand. I don't know how to pronounce this brand and I'm just like okay let's call it Cos RX. I'm using this Cos RX Alloy Soothing Sun Cream SPF 15 and it's really good. Actually this is my first time using it. Stick it on my face just like that because sunscreen is important and I don't really use primer, I don't know why. I really love the smell. Oh, my face looks so glowy and fresh. That's why I don't really use primer because I think sunscreen kind of help my skin, like prep my skin really well. So yeah. And then for concealer, I'm using this L'Oreal Infallible Full Wear Concealer in the shade Casmer. I think this shade is too white for me, but I can handle it because it's kind of oxidized later, so no worry. And sticking this product on on my under eye my nose bridge my chin my forehead and some spot on my face and I'm gonna blend this out with this brush like 80% and the rest I'm using my fingers to just blend this baby blending see it you can see it guys this is too white really really white for me but i can handle it no problem but i'm so in love with l'oreal like liquid makeup i really love l'oreal infallible foundation and this concealer too when it comes to like concealer or foundation, I really love L'Oreal because I don't know, it's about the formula, I think. It contains a lot of product. I can handle it, guys. This is really too light for me. But it's all good. I mean, like, the formula is good, like well done, but it's too late for me, so it's all my fault. It's all my fault. Honestly, it doesn't look so bad. It will oxidize later, so... Oh yeah, I forget to put on chopstick on my lips this is nivea strawberry shine okay 
maybe a strawberry shine and this is have like a real strawberry flavor if you know what I mean then you know it because my lips are so dry so I so this is a must for me and with my finger I'm gonna blend the rest of this concealer and using this Laura Mercier translucent loose setting powder to set my face obviously I could light an SI for this this is really good For eyebrow, I'm using Makeover Eyebrow Definition Kit in Dark Brown. I really love this because I don't know. I just see. I just love brow powder, and it is a cheap one, and it's really good. I'm not going too too crazy with my eyebrow because it's everyday makeup, so I don't really like. A bold eyebrow but if you want to it's okay it's all about what you what makes you comfortable the most for me this is not bold eyebrow but I don't know about you guys maybe this is like the bold version of you but it's like natural version of me the concealer on its package so I'm gonna use this to kind of define my eyebrow I'm done with my eyebrows and for my eyeshadow I'm honestly going to use this contour just to darken it up a little bit and a little bit of definition With my finger, I'm gonna blend it out. Okay, I'm sorry guys for not telling this one. This is El Agro Pro Conceal in the say Dark Cocoa. And I'm just sliding my finger on my lower lash line. Not like really putting a lot on and curling my lashes I always curl my lashes before I put my mascara because it makes such a difference and back with my makeover eyebrow kit I'm using this just to kind of make a line and smudge it up a little bit for my everyday makeup I really love keeping everything cohesive on my face like I'm using this product on my eyebrow and for my eyeliner and I'm gonna use my contour for my eyeshadow and like real contour on my face and for mascara I'm using this L'Oreal Last Paradise, my favorite mascara ever. I'm a big eye present when it comes to makeup, so I love using like a ton of mascara on my lashes. And I really love L'Oreal Last Paradise because it fans out my lashes and it makes my eyes beautiful in my opinion I don't know but I don't know about you guys and I'm using this peach rose matte melt liquid lip color from Lacme absolute and I literally just like put it on my cheek like that and blend it out and it gives you a really like natural flush and it's so pretty and 
I added a little bit on my chin and the tip of my nose I really love Lakme Absolute's formula because it's not sticky or anything and it just blends into your skin so I'm using this again LA Girl Pro Contour in the shade Dark Cocoa to contour my face and typically I just squeeze it a little bit so be careful when you use it when you squeeze it because it's so dark I don't know why I'm using this but I love this so be careful when you squeeze it just make sure the top gets wet not like a ton of product comes out and put it on my face like that on here too because everyone wants to get rid of double chin I know a little bit on my forehead and of course my nose there are so many people that do not contour their nose mine it's not cute at all so I must contour it and blend everything out with my finger again I don't know I love using my finger because it's simple and easy the lighting keeps changing you can see the difference on my nose for highlighter I'm using makeover rich glow face highlighter actually this is so pretty and I'm using this blending brush and not be really careful with my highlighter it's like a circle motion when I put this on my face this is half like a teeny tiny particles and it makes like you have a natural glow there you go and with one of this brush I'm using this to add highlighter on the inner corner of my eyes it's kind of define your eyes a little bit like shape your eyes I really love putting highlighter on the inner corner of my eyes like it's a must and finally for my lips okay hold on guys Okay, for my lips, I'm using this Maybelline Sensational Liquid Made in this shade, I don't know, 6, in number 6, and with Super Stay in Crayon. Yes. First, I'm gonna apply this onto my lips. You can literally stop in here but i'm gonna add a little bit of red using this on the inner part of my lips and we're done so this is the final look just like easy fast and simple makeup for everyday makeup routine especially for summer good for beginners too and it's quarantine friendly <laughs> I really like how it turns out because I'm just going with the flow and it turns out pretty well and thank you so much guys for watching this video you guys making it through this far and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and comment down below 
specifically what you want me to do on my next video and yeah thank you so much for watching i'll see you on my next video don't forget to subscribe